The Dead Sea is one of the most interesting and unique places on Earth. It is not actually a sea, but a saltwater lake that is famous for its extremely high salt content, making it one of the saltiest bodies of water in the world. Located between Jordan, Israel, and the West Bank, the Dead Sea is an amazing natural wonder that has fascinated people for thousands of years. Learning about the Dead Sea helps us understand why it is so special and how it has been important to people throughout history. One of the most surprising things about the Dead Sea is that people can float on its surface. The high salt content in the water makes it very dense, so it's much easier to float than in regular water. If you try to swim in the Dead Sea, you won't have to work hard at all to stay on top of the water. The salt keeps you afloat like a natural life jacket. It's a fun experience for people who visit the area, and it's also great for your skin, as the saw helps remove dead skin cells and leaves your skin feeling smooth. The Dead Sea is so salty that it has a salinity level that is about 10 times higher than the ocean. The high salt levels come from minerals like sodium chloride and magnesium. The water in the Dead Sea doesn't flow into the ocean, so it doesn't get diluted with fresh water. Because of this, the water evaporates very quickly under the hot sun, leaving behind large amounts of salt and minerals on the surface. One of the most unique aspects of the Dead Sea is its low elevation. It is the lowest point on Earth's surface, sitting at more than 1,400 feet below sea level. This makes it a place where you can experience a part of the Earth that is really far below the rest of the planet. The air around the Dead Sea is also rich in oxygen, which makes it a special place for people with breathing problems or skin conditions like psoriasis. Many people visit the Dead Sea to enjoy its healing properties and natural mud treatments. The mud from the Dead Sea is another amazing feature. The mud is rich in minerals like magnesium, calcium, and potassium, which are great for your skin. People from all over the world visit the Dead Sea to cover their skin with the mud, which is said to have healing and beautifying effects. It's not just great for skin. The mud is also used in spas for treatments like massages, facials, and body wraps. Throughout history, the Dead Sea has been a special place for many people. It has been mentioned in ancient texts, including the Bible, and was known for its healing properties long before it became a popular tourist destination. In the ancient world, people believed that the water and minerals of the Dead Sea could cure ailments and improve health. Even today, it is known for its therapeutic benefits, and many people travel to the Dead Sea for medical treatments. Despite its name, the Dead Sea is not completely lifeless. While you won't find fish or many plants in the water because the salt levels are so high, there are still some microorganisms that live in the Dead Sea. These tiny organisms have adapted to the extreme conditions, and they play a role in the unique environment of the lake. The Dead Sea is also an important part of the environment. Unfortunately, the water levels of the Dead Sea have been shrinking over the years. This is mainly due to the diversion of water from the Jordan River, which is the main source of fresh water for the Dead Sea. The reduction in water flow has caused the lake to shrink and dry up in certain areas. Efforts are being made to protect the Dead Sea and find ways to preserve it for future generations.